The South Bend area has many different types of high schools, ranging from traditional to magnet and now Montessori. This is a high school that is meant to be um, small. It's a micro high school. It's meant to be downtown as an urban high school to utilize all of our downtown resources. We call it city as a classroom. And it's also meant to be Montessori. Montessori schools typically run from early childhood to eighth grade, but the founders of River Montessori High School wanted to apply this approach through the later teenage years. We looked at South Bend and saw that we had Montessori available from the early ages to eighth grade, and then not at the high school age. And the college scene seems to be more naturally a Montessori setting. And so we wanted to, one, kind of close the gap of Montessori that existed here in South Bend, um, and also just make South Bend um, a nice Montessori hub for students that would like to have that experience through their entire educational career. My reason was for the like independent learning and being able to pursue the avenues that I like in learning, like arts and creativity and um, um, being able to learn at my own pace and sort of like excel in the areas that I can excel in and then also have um, leniency in the areas that I need leniency in. For ninth grade, I went to Penn High School, which was certainly an experience. Um, and so the school opened the year after that. And so I had already been thinking, maybe I don't want to keep going to Penn. Um, and then Montessori School is opening and sort of Montessori promises a lot of freedom of choice in education. So I was like, sure, maybe this, maybe this will be the place for me. With the pandemic and everything, it was, I was feeling sort of like disconnected from my school. I, I really enjoy learning, but I was sort of losing that love for learning. And so uh, my parents and I made the decision to come here instead. And it's definitely helped. I, I really enjoy being, uh, being a student here. There aren't many high schools that are Montessori. And from what I've seen about it, it looked like a really good high school. So I wanted to come here and try it out. River Montessori uses the Montessori method to, to really work on the social and emotional development of students. And I think in the adolescent age is such a critical time to be including that in the curriculum. And so Montessori is not just how we deliver academics, but it's also how we deliver um, those social emotional skill practices to our adolescents. Individualized learning is even able to provide further opportunities for personal growth. They can expect to have a very um, unique experience in education by being able to build out some of their own education um, courses, uh, focusing on their passions, their skills. And so coming here helps students really have um, much more control over what their academic experience looks like. In our physics class, I got to build a Rube Goldberg and so um, I got to take a bunch of like trinkets and wood and um, sort of construct a thing that could eventually, with energy transfers, pop a balloon. So that was super cool. They got a good math program. They use Alex. And that's probably my favorite thing to do here. We have some like big projects that we do at the end of like uh, cycles. And I really, really enjoy those. Usually they're pretty relevant to my interests. So it's like working with a group and we do like a big presentation and it's always really fun. I, I really like that. And I really, I get to do a lot of art projects uh, and art is sort of my thing. So I really like being able to do those. I really like uh, sort of the whole ethos of work. So we have follow-ups, which basically mean we, you know, we learn the material in class and then we demonstrate that knowledge in some way with a follow-up. So there are options provided that you can use, or you can sort of come up with something on your own, so you can really dig into the aspect that you're most interested in. We're in an urban setting on purpose because we really can utilize um, our city resources, like our great redeveloped downtown library and um, Music City Village and the Croc Center. So all of these resources that are close to us, we're, we're building into our curriculum and really using um, the city as part of our classroom. We've gotten to go to the art museum and work with them with like pottery and um, other things like metal smithing. Um, I've gotten to work downtown with creative writing in like Chicory and the Chocolate Cafe and the library. 
We've gotten to workshop things, um, other spaces downtown. Some of the students have been taught in Montessori schools their entire lives. I was very n nervous at first when I was going to have to transfer to like a public school that wasn't Montessori and there's like thousands of kids there and it has a very like rigid academic plan and we sort of were like setting that up and so I think like knowing that I could be in an environment that I'm familiar with and comfortable with um, and like with a, that socially and academically was reassuring for me. It felt pretty good because, you know, that's what I'm used to, so it was, it was a good feeling. Well, for others, this is a brand new experience. It's definitely been sort of an interesting transition. Um, I'd say I, I've, I picked it up pretty easily, but, like, there were definitely some things where it took a bit to sort of understand, like, I can do this in this way and not the way that I've done it my whole life. It's more community oriented, both towards like the larger community and the community within the school. And there's a lot more, you have to be willing to do the work to steer your own education. But as soon as you're ready to do that work, there's so many options available. River Montessori High School is using the Montessori approach not just to teach academics. It's using it to address social and emotional learning during those formative adolescent years. Montessori in a high school setting really focuses on those social emotional uh, development skills that really at the adolescent age is so very important um, and so that's not just Montessori is not just being used here as an academic um, medium it's also being used uh, to really help students practice those social emotional skills and that is just woven into the fabric of Montessori.